Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I am here with a Valentine's Day look. This is more of a guy friendly makeup look. I know guys get scared off by the red lips and a lot of makeup, so I tried to make this look sultry yet kind of guy friendly and not scare them off kind of look. Um, kind of with some soft pinky nudish colored lips and just a real pretty smoky dreamy kind of smoky dreamy eye. So if you guys like this look and you're interested to see how I got it, just keep watching. So you definitely want to prime your eyes and I'm just going to use this Urban Decay eyeshadow potion and I'm just going to put this on the lid. You can use either a black coal pencil or even gel liner. I'm just going to use this gel liner by Wet n Wild. This is part of the um, Fergie collection. And I'm just going to dip my brush into there and I'm just going to add a little bit onto my lid just so when I put the eyeshadow on it will kind of make the eyeshadow pop a little bit make it look a little deeper. Okay, so I put it over the majority of my eye, but I'm leaving the inner corner open just a tad so that the highlight will peek through better. So you should have something pretty funky looking like this. So using the original Naked palette, I'm going to go in with the color Gunmetal right here. And I'm going to pack that on the entire lid. And I'm not going to sweep it like this. I'm going to pack the color on so it's more intense. Then I'm just going to take a clean fluffy brush and blend the edges a little bit. Then I'm going to go in with the color called Naked and I'm going to mix a little bit of buck with it. I'm just going to apply this in my crease. take this peachy color called Nectar from the Lorac Pro 2 palette. Any peach will do and I'm just going to add a little bit of that kind of in the crease area just to warm it up just a tad. Okay so then for my highlight I'm going to use the color called Virgin and it's just kind of a creamy beigey highlight. And I'm just going to place that right below my brow. And I'm going to place that on the inner corner. And I'm just going to drag that towards the inner portion of the lid. Just about a third. Yeah, about a third the way in. So that's what the eyeshadow will look like. Now I'm just going to tight line my waterline. I want a really intense black look so I'm just going to use my gel liner. I want it to be really intense so I'm just going to go back with that gel liner and then do my waterline with that. I'm 
just gonna wing it just a little bit. Finish doing this eye and put on some mascara and I'll be right back. Okay, so I just finished applying my mascara and my eyeliner and this is the look that, and this is the finished look. With this look you'll want to warm up your face a bit, so I'm just going to take this Too Faced Chocolate Bronzer and this is the Medium Deep Matte Bronzer and I'm just going to warm up my face with this a little bit. Then I'm just going to go in with this highlighter by Too Faced and it's in the color Inner Light right here. So I'm just going to go in with that and highlight just a little bit down the bridge of the nose, the cheeks. And then on my Cupid's bow. So I'm going to take that same palette, using that same palette, I'm going to go in with this color called Papa Don't Preach right here. And it's just like a peachy, corally blush and this will just help warm up the, this will just help warm up the look a little bit. Okay, so I'm gonna go for like a pinky nude mouth and this lip. So I'm gonna use this lip liner by NYX and this is in the color, it's in the color nude pink. And it's just the retractable lip liner. And I'm not, and I'm staying within my lip line. I'm not overlining. And then fill it in. Then I'm going to go in with this Maybelline lipstick and blushing beige and I am just going to go back in with that lip liner and kind of define the lips just a little bit more And one more added step you could do um, to highlight the lips even more and kind of help uh, your and kind of help your lipstick stay a little bit more, a little bit longer, is just take a shimmery pink eyeshadow and place it right on the center of your lips. And that will help even, and that, that little trick even helps mattify your lipstick.
and that's the finished look guys I really hope you enjoyed this you can always go for either a neuter lip a neuter <laughs> A lighter lip you could always go for a lighter lip or even a darker lip would look pretty um, just if you're gonna use this for Valentine's Day guys just get freaked out by red lipstick or hot pink just any bright color really so I don't know why guys freak out about lip color but so I thought this lip color might be guy friendly <laughs> if you're not going sorry if you're not <laughs> if you're not okay <laughs> If you're not gonna go, this is ridiculous. Um, if you're okay, okay. So, oh my gosh, every single time, go sit down. Go, go get your kennel. Sorry about that. Um, I don't know what I was saying. I don't know what I was saying. Um. Yeah, so this is guy friendly. Guy friendly. <laughs> you guys have to see. Okay, so. Oh, hi, baby. Hi, Lola. Hi, Lola. So, I would say this is guy friendly um, lipstick. And if you're not going out with a guy on Valentine's Day like me, um, and going out with your girls. You could totally play this up and be, be really dramatic. I don't know, just have fun with it. Just have fun with it. Do whatever makes you feel happy. And you know what? If the guy don't like it, then too bad. He's got to love you for you, right? Anyways, um, yeah. I hope you guys liked this video. <laughs> Somebody's wanting my attention. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed this video, even though it's crazy. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you like this look. I'm going to put a few more. I'm going to try to put a few more Valentine's Day looks for you guys up. So if there's a certain look you want to see, just let me know in the comments down below. I'll also list all the products I use down below. Um, anyways, I hope you guys are doing well, and I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching, and subscribe if you haven't, and yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!